And just, we're just people that want to have a nice place to live, right? Gary Henderson is 55 years old. He has been staying at a senior's homeless shelter in Abbotsford for two weeks now. He says finding a place to stay has never been more difficult. Pretty much impossible because you know, the rents are so high. And, you know, most people are on social assistance or disability and no one wants to rent you a place. You know. The 12-bed shelter has opened up more spaces due to the cold temperatures. This space is specific to seniors 55 and up. No, I was stuck outside for three weeks. I had nowhere to go, and I came here, and I talked to Jesse, and he got me in here right away. And, uh, and well, of course, well, I'm handicapped too, so like, I was very, very grateful for that. Because being in my condition, I can't really do too much, right? The residents emotional to have finally found a place inside away from the cold. We have really not too much room, but it's okay. And despite the cramped conditions, it's a safe space. It's home. It's my home and it's everybody's home who lives here. But an ever increasing need for shelter space is challenging organizations to find more room, especially for seniors who are more vulnerable to health issues and can't handle long stretches spent outside in the cold. There's, they've, they've hit brick wall upon brick wall upon brick wall and then they end up here and they're like, why, isn't, why is this the only place? And the amount of space that we have is not nearly enough. Gateway Church in Abbotsford also opening its doors, offering an emergency weather shelter until March from 8 p.m. until 8 a.m. daily. But the demand for a place to stay is extremely high. Here in Abbotsford, we are seeing numbers of people homeless that we have never seen before uh, in the history of our city. It would not be an outlandish estimation to say that there are probably 700 plus people who are currently without a home in Abbotsford. But for now, people who have a roof over their heads are grateful, but are worried for what comes next. The snowfall expected to hit the city Saturday, followed by cold temperatures for the rest of the week. Yasmin Gantam, CBC News, Abbotsford.